Welcome or welcome back and I need help at C squared. In this example, we have an uh, equation given in the uh, rectangular mode, rectangular form, and we want to change the polar equation. These are the guy we're going to use. Now, by, by, first of all, let's take a look. What is the shape of this uh, curve given by this equation? This is a circle. Circle, radius of 3 and I'm sorry, center 3 and 0 and radius of 3, all right? So we'll see at the end if we get something like that. So first of all, what I'm going to do, I'm, here I'm going to raise to the second power x minus 3, and that will be x squared minus 6x plus 9. If you don't see that, uh, do x minus 3 times x minus 3, and you'll see you get this expression. Plus y squared equals 9. So now you should notice what? We have x squared plus y squared, there, these two guys, right? So that will be r squared minus, instead of x, I'm going to use this guy, r cosine of theta plus 9 equals 9. And now you notice these 9s, we can subtract on both sides, or you can simply cancel them, like I cancel them. Okay, there are both of them positive 9, so you can do that. And then we can factor out an r. So we have r, r minus 6 cosine of theta equals 0, which gives us two equations. 1, r equals 0, right? r equals 0 is one equation, and the other one, r minus 6 cosine of theta equals 0, which gives us r equals 6 cosine of theta. Okay, these two equations represent the polar form of the given equation, and this one is the pole itself, right? R equals zero is the pole, and we're going to concentrate more on this guy. Okay, so let's see now what we get on the graphing calculator. Okay, this is a TI-83 I use. I clear the RAMs. I am in, I am in radian and in the polar mode, uh, and I get those R's, and look at here. I put this sensor here. Okay, and let's see what we get. We get a circle. You see, we get this circle, and you look like radius is 3 and 0, and yeah, the radius is 3. Uh, the picture doesn't look like a circle because the window is not square. Uh, go and change the window with a square window, and you're going to see something like that. If you do not see it, the last thing you may want to do is check your window. You should have these little things, and uh, you should be fine. If you enjoyed this little clip, don't forget to click the like button and come back and see square for more help. Thank you.